Hi, my name is Danny Rodriguez and I'm a counseling student from Rollins, Wyoming. Right now I consider myself a lay counselor. I feel I'm a very empathetic person and people are drawn to me and trust me with issues that they're going through in their lives. I've had multiple church callings where I was trusted by authorities to lead the young people to reach their goals they have made in their lives. And this has brought me a lot of joy in my life. I wish to aspire to be a professional counselor with Christian worldview. Some things I have to pay attention to as I progress to becoming a professional counselor is to be as non-judgmental as possible. This could include verbal and non-verbal cues, such as body language, eye rolls, and other non-verbal cues. By doing this, it might upset the client and deter their progression when it comes to the state of their mental health. This could be, there would be no trust issues and it would be hard to have long lasting relationships with the clients. I hope I don't miss the boat on this question, but I see my views aligning with an integrated model because I have scriptures, parables, and Christian tools in my arsenal. If it is something that would benefit and comfort my client, I would be able to utilize these tools in our sessions. All of this would be under the discretion of the client if Christian values would benefit them in our sessions. Challenges in an integrated model may be telling the clients what they are doing wrong and how to fix themselves with an outside perspective. Whereas I believe a client needs time to know of God's love and to work out what works best for them and God on their own with someone to talk things out with. When I consider A.4 dot B of the um, ACA Code of Ethics, I understand it is in place to keep my personal beliefs from being used unethically. This gives the client space to have their own opinions and to use me as a sounding board for their progression without feeling shame. As I pursue a degree in professional counseling, the ACA Code of Ethics reminds me of who I am as a confidant and how to best serve the clients who come to me. As a professional counselor, I can progress in a Christian world because I would utilize my profession as a guide to help clients feel the love of our Savior that our Savior has for them. So they can have the comfort level needed to move forward, progressing day to day. It's easy for me to tell the clients I know I am the son of my Heavenly Father, but, it's, but it is ultimately more beneficial to a client to know this for themselves. They're, they'll appreciate the road they've gone down if they travel it on their own time frame rather than me or anyone else pushing our agenda. Thank you very much.